So I'm here in Colmar, it's next to Strasbourg. There's an airport here. But what's more important, yo, look at that. Isis, there she is. Look at that. And um, so Bartholdi, he lived in Colmar. And he was a Freemason. And I think it was in 1886 he went to um, Egypt to, for inspiration. And when he came back, he came back with this here. Uh, people say this is the light bearer. So that means Lucifer. But I, do you see any light? I don't see any light. There is no light. But what I do see, it's supposed to be like uh, represent fire. So that's because of the, um, the four elements which are in the statue integrated. That's why there are the seven rays. And the seven rays is the number of a pyramid. I already told you so. Um, the square and compass. The square, it stands for the number four. There are the four elements. You see, there's a lot of air here. There's fire. There's earth, you know, just standing on this thing here. And there should be water. Oh yeah, there's a big lake next to it. Oh, that's the water. But of course, in New York, there's a lot of water around it. So the four elements, they are there. And that's the, um, with the number four, number three, you can make a pyramid because the square stands for number four. There are four sides in it. And the sides, it's, it's a triangle. So it stands for the number three. For Isis, Horus, and Seth. So Isis is here. Horus is always everywhere. Uh, I mean, um, um, Seth. With his Seth on, or Satan. He's supposed to be everywhere. And probably, well, this here is the new world order, the new system, which is a horizontal rule. I already explained it to you dozens of times. In the aristocracy, there was a law which was called the primogeniture, that only the firstborn son, he would get everything. But there was also second, third and fourth sons and they wanted to rule as well. So for them, there was nothing. So that's why there were so many conspiracies, like in the castle, you know, to get the, um, the power. A lot of backstabbings, poisonings. And for them there was a um, tradition to go into a monastery because the firstborn son he didn't want them anymore in the castle. So he threw them out. And there, was, there were only three things in the Middle Ages. The, um, the aristocracy, the church and the people. And of course they didn't want to hide among the people. Because um, you have to work, you know, and be in the cow shit and pig shit up to your neck. And an arist aristocrat doesn't work. And um, so they went into a monastery. And at a certain moment, there were so many in the monastery. They said, we're in a monastery, which is a temple of God. And uh, so we are, the, um, we are the Templars. And we're going to make a new system that every one of us can be the king for a period of four, five or seven years. Which became a horizontal rule. And it's in the book. It's all this, the description of it is in the book. I don't know what it says here. Four, ah, the 4th of July, yeah. Well, that, that's, that's when the American New World Order took place and they, they like chased away the firstborn son. That's the English king, yeah. See so why I get it. That's why Mr. Trump, he can't do what he wants because there's always the Senate and the Congress to say, no, 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 Donald, we all rule together. Yeah, and um, so actually this is the sun, Horus, is this here, the book, the new world order, and the new man as well, that's why we had so many world wars, you know, to, um, to raise man new from scratch, and not anymore after the image of God, there was no more tradition from a father to a son, and they, the children were risen, you know, by the telly, and, 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 and only by the uh, the mothers, like, you know, you see what I mean? 
So this is the seven rays. Actually the seven rays stands for a pyramid and it stands for the square and compass. Just like skull and bones which is three, two, two. If you add it up you get to number seven. And they put the G in the middle of the square and compass which is, happens to be the seventh letter as well. So but look, at the, look at the face. Is that a woman? Hey mate, this is a bloke. It's a bloody homo, isn't it? Well, this is Seth at the same time. It's Isis and it's Seth. You know, because the women, they have an alliance with the devil. Just like in the Bible with Adam and Eve, you know. Because there was the first rite, you know, the Eus Primae Noctis in the Middle Ages. You know, she had, on the first night of her marriage, she had to sleep with the Lord in the castle. And he really, you know, shagged her, you know what I mean? And uh, many women, they didn't like it, you know, they burned them later on, the ones who didn't want to go into this uh, collaboration with the evil ones, with the pharaohs, actually. Because the aristocracy, they are from pharaoh. So they... You know, they said, well, you know, well, some of them said, well, well, after all, it was not so bad. He was a prince, after all. He got some wine, you know, he was smelling good. So there was an alliance took place. This is the real story of Adam and Eve, actually. Our women... They're not real women anymore, they have an alliance with the aristocracy due to this, yeah? So this is what the seven rays mean. It means Isis, Horus and Seth for the three, yeah? And water, fire, air, and um, water, fire, air, and, and earth for the other four, which is the base of a pyramid and the three stands for the side of a pyramid. So with this, you know, and uh, the name of this guy here in Colmar, actually this is Route to Strasbourg, going to Strasbourg, where there's the European Parliament. From here to there, it's going to the European Parliament, where they rule Europe. It looks like the Babylon Tower. And um, they have a very important school. I filmed that one where the French president was in it. It's in a, in a former Templar's commandery. It's called LENA, uh, L'Ecole Nationale de l'Administration. Even foreign presidents, they get taught here how to lie to us, because the word Parliament is from the French parler et mentir, to talk and to lie. You remember Lafayette, you know, the, uh, the American New World Order has nothing to do with Illuminati or all that, you know. The Illuminati is just one of the older Freemason lodges. But this one here, who gave this Statue of Liberty to, to the US, they are far more dangerous. It's the, the French Freemason Lodge, um, Voltaire et les Neuf Sœurs. And uh, yeah, well, well, let's go back to my backpack. Oh yeah, what I wanted to tell you, the guy's name is Bartholdi. He's here from Colmar, which is actually Swiss territory here because the Swiss mercenaries they murdered everybody in this region in the 30-year uh, war from 1618 to 1648 uh, and um, um, they are like um, ethnic Swiss here and his name was uh, Frederick Auguste Bartholdi probably an ethnic Swiss as well and Frederick because of the Emperor the German Emperor Frederick the Great who was a homo, he liked to rape young German soldiers in one war after another and he was, um, Hitler he was a big fan of his you know, he always walked around with a uh, painting of uh, uh, Fritz the Faggot how they call them, the Germans, they call him Fritz the Faggot yeah? and August, it's a Roman Emperor yeah, you get it? probably another homo, it's all homos, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, the Australia just passing by. <laughs> yeah, just like this one here. They're all homos. That's why he put it in it. You know, a woman, Isis, with a man's face. They're all homos. They're all sick. Yeah. It's a man. It looks like the same face like the Nazis use, you know, like, you know, putting your hands up like this, yeah. Oh, what a world we live in, eh? So the French, the, uh, the word Statue of Liberty, it comes from the French slogan 
uh, Liberté, Fraternité, Égalité, after the French Revolution. Actually, the New World Order in the US was founded before the French, uh, a couple of years later. It was the French Revolution, the French New World Order. The New World Order was in 1789 and the American one was in 1776, as we all know. And so they said, Liberté, Fraternité, Égalité. That is why the name, the Statue of Liberty, derives from. So that means liberty. Now we all, including the second, third and the fourth sons of the aristocracy, we all have the liberty to be the king for a period of four, five or seven years. Four in America and five in France. It can't came out. And Fraternité, Fraternity, we have no more internal wars. We're all the same, you know, égalité, equality. So, well, we can all be the king for four or five or seven years, yeah? You get it? It's still the aristocracy ruling. And they found out six years ago with the uh, genetic analysis, the DNA, that more than 50% of the Europeans and the Yanks as well, probably, they have the pharaonic genetics in them. How is this possible? Egypt over there, this is France. Well, it's quite easy. It's because they use prime noctis. On the first night of the marriage in the Middle Ages, the, this aristocracy who always ruled and terrorized us for thousands of years. So, the, you know, they are pharaohs. They injected their pharaonic genetics in the hole of our women. You see it? Fire in the hole, yeah? There we go. Fire in the hole. Yeah, that's that's her. Probably doesn't have a hole. Only in the backside, eh? A homo face with a. I mean, it's a man, you know. It's, 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 it makes me sick, eh? So it's not only the seven rays, the holy number of the pyramid and the Freemasons, the square and compass, adding up to seven G, three two two skull and bones. Um, here in the Swiss buffer zone, zone. Oh, if you go that way, you get to Switzerland, and if you go that way, you get to Strasbourg. You know, Switzerland rules the world. Don't forget it. This is the sisters of ISIS. You know. Uh, oh, I forgot what I wanted to say. Oh gosh. Um, seven. Yeah. What was it? Seven. The holy number. Oh, I forgot it. Sorry. Uh, here's a commemoration thing here. There he is. A Swiss A. Of course it's a Swiss A. You know, like holding the world, the world domination. It's sort of a museum there. It's how they build it. Well, you all know this, yeah. Les étapes de la construction. Mr. Frédéric Auguste Barthold. Oh, his first name is Neuner, yeah. Oh. And here's some... Uh, the, lo the, the logo of uh, Colmar. This is where I'm standing at. So here's the text. You can all read it here. There you go. So it was in uh, all the big, big talk here. A bunch of liars. The independence of the United States. I can't get out of here. Yeah, independence from the firstborn son, eh? We've got the new system, the new world order. I'm standing here in the Swiss buffer zone all around Switzerland. It's Vorarlberg in Austria, Baden-Württemberg and, and Bavaria in Germany. Oh, look at that. It's a pyramid passing by. Yeah, yeah. Colmar Champagne. Yeah, it's all Freemason stuff here. Look, there's another pyramid here. It's a hotel. It's all over. I'm, I'm pretty sure if I go dig around here, but I'm tired, you know, I've been walking with all 30 k's around my neck. There's some more pyramids here. There's the, another logo of Colmar. Oh, man. I'm pretty sure if I walk around here, I'll find obelisk, I'll find the whole bloody thing as usual. Yeah. We're being ruled by pharaohs and Switzerland is their base. Now, wakey, wakey, wakey. This is not the light bearer. It's one of the four elements, the fire. This is the fire, this is the air, this is the earth, and there's a big lake next to it. In New York, you won't find the water very far away, right? That's what it means. Oh, yeah. And the light bearer, you know, there's a, there's a place called Switzerland within Switzerland. 
It's called Liechtenstein. It means the stone of light, which is probably really the center of the center of evil, tax evasion, well, you name it, everything. Yeah, go on, go on, seagulls, you go and shit on it. Yeah, go on, go shit on the lady. <laughs> Liechtenstein, the stone of light, Illuminati. Yeah, if, you want, if you're looking for Illuminati, but I tell you, it's just one of them. There's so many lodges. So it's a bit hard, you know, to get in the middle. I, I'd like to see if it's octagonal, octagon. But yeah, I, you know, I don't want to get run over. Here. It's really, it's, it's a lot of traffic. And they, it's the end of the day. They all want to get home, you know. And hello, darling. You put the telly on, all right? Already? You know? Wow. So they're all nervous, they want to go home, they're all frustrated, you know. But this is a bloke, eh? This is not a woman. I saw these things like in Nuremberg with the Nazis, you know. You know if you put a helmet on it, you know, and then like Zeke Heil, Zeke Heil, you know, you get the same face. Right. It's a bloke. You know, just by looking around here, it says the Sun King. Yeah. Prestige, Le Roi Soleil. Yeah, well, just by looking around, you know, if, if somebody would drive me around, I've really got a pain in my leg, you know, I would, I would dig deeper, deeper in it, but I'm really tired. You know, I'm sleeping rough all the time outside since two years, and so somebody help me, and we do some more, eh? Well, you know what to go dig, yeah. Dig it. But that's the new world order, Horus. So it's the back side of it. The hair knot. Samurai stuff. And uh, so this thing is inspired by Egypt. And uh, of course it's uh, July, like in July 4th, it's seven, seven rays here. Um, it's uh, 1776, another two seven, and it's all over the numerology in the uh, in the statue itself. It takes too long to to, to call it all out, you know. But... So I'm going to hitchhike here. Ah, oh, bloody hell! How am I going to do this? So you wish me luck, eh? Two Frenchies knocked on each other there. Little accident. Oh, ladies. Uh, wow. Okay. Bye bye, Farah. So here, here am I, hitchhiking here. Oh, there we go. Nobody's stopping. I wish me luck. They're all going that fast. I have to stop in the grass here. There's some holes in it. Okay, who takes me hitchhiking? Yo, know, look, there's another hitchhiker. Yeah, she's got this, her thumb up as well. Oh, yeah. Come on, let's hitchhike it together, eh? So the Statue of Liberty also stands, you know, it's a woman with a man's head. It all also stands for the alliance our women have with Pharaoh. It's also, in a manner of speaking, it's Eve. See what I mean? I have to shout with such such a noise and nobody's taking me um, and it's also the Horus matrix killing of you know of our sons and um, killing of, of man so they can't raise their sons that's all what it means everything you know it's a horrible symbol it is very evil uh, 